Hello, today I am continuing Spider-Man. This episode we're going to meet Mr. Negative. We're at a Fisk construction site. Looks like the demons are moving in on Fisk's territory. You. Wait, the demons. Who's their leader? Keep my men alive and maybe I'll tell you. Stay back! Your men are safe. Your turn. Who runs the demon? Check the roof. I hit the wrong button. Go! Chase time. I live to regret this. Hi! I need to disable the helicopter's engines. Land! You got this, you got this! First person, and I thought it was a quick time event, so I failed. You might want to bring a ladder. It's Come Miles. Uh, nah, I gotta get to City Hall for my dad's ceremony. New suit. Jeff's being Here's rewarded. We're watching it with MJ. A, a truck pulled away from the scene from a company called Consolidated Shipping. We all know that Officer Davis is a hero. Acts of extraordinary bravery. It is my privilege to present the Department Medal of Honor. Phone call, sir. It sounds urgent, sir. Over the coming days, your company, your city, and everything you care about will be destroyed. People will beg you for help, but you won't be able to save them. Why don't you grow a pair and tell me what you want? To watch you suffer. Wait, I just remembered what happens here. It's a Mr. Negative Goon. That's Martin Lee, traitor. Jeff, no. Jeff's dead. Are we Miles? Peter, Miles Wait, is alive. Stay here. I'm going to find your father. Peter, no. Mom. We found our mom being crushed. I have to go find dad, okay? Miles, no! Stealth mission. <laughs> Jeff might be alive. He can save us. Enough! We have to leave. He betrayed us but saved Miles. Yeah. Jeff's dead. No! I'm sorry for your loss. Do I know you? I'm Peter Parker, I just wanted to say, I know what you're going through. It all gets easier with time. Don't worry. It's, it's part of God's plan. I'm sorry, I was just try trying to help. I'm sorry about that. Have you started looking for Martin Lee yet? No, I told you I can't start a manhunt based on a hunch from Spider-Man. Get me some solid evidence and we'll talk. Even Yuri doesn't believe me. Then it's up to us to find him. I've been doing some research. Go to this address. Martin Lee bought a controlling interest in this recycling center last year. I talked with a detective about questioning the arrested demons. They're all claiming Martin Lee has the power to, quote, corrupt people. Say it's sort of like mind control. It brings out the negative part of you. It makes you do things you wouldn't normally do. How's the son Miles doing? Not good. It's something to do outside of school. Maybe a part-time job? But it has to be the right job. Something that makes him feel useful, like what he's doing matters. Kind of think you just described Feast. The place is crawling with demons. I got inside the building. That's We're investigating the room. Tech equipment. Maybe later I can recycle this stuff into some weapons of my own. These must be where they're planning to attack. Wait, these are Osborne campaign offices. All the paths originate from the same address. Guns from Fisk's armory. Truck bombs. This is crazy. Explosives from Fisk's construction site. This wasn't a gang war. The demons were stealing from Fisk to go after Mayor Osborne. Lee's using this place as a front for the demons. Bomb making, gun running, and it looks like they're planning another attack. This time on Norman Osborne's campaign offices. I found an address here. I think it's their staging area. If I hurry, I might be able to stop them. Martin Lee and the demons are planning another attack. This time on Norman Osborne's campaign office. I'm sending you the address of a recycling center. 
You'll find all the evidence there. If you're wrong about this, you're gonna help me find a new job. Consolidated shipping. New gadget. Invoice from an auto shop. Pale horse rides. That's one expensive tune-up. They have bases all around the city. He has whiplashes. I think I stopped the demon's attack on Osborne's campaign office. Did you find me? But I found something we should look into. A place called Pale Horse Ride. Copy, Silverbird. What? Who are these people? There's I'm executing this son of a... Hey! Peter, we have launched That's like 50 people things. off the top Damn. floor of buildings, yeah. so I think you do execute people. Code SM1. Whoa, whoa! Code SM1. Holding... Release him! He works with us! Explanation, please? This is Silver Sablanova, head of Sable International, a private security force, paid for by Mayor Osborne. Next time you get in my way, I will not be so gentle. I don't trust her, and she's got her hey, soldiers all over the city. Thing. Any progress on the Martin Lee angle? Anyway, Sable has the mayor's ear and unchecked authority. We've searched that address you gave me, found plenty of evidence of a bomb plot, but nothing that leads back to Martin. Sable to sure and the demons available. are fighting. Could always use more help. You know anyone? Actually, I do. We're trying this to get into locked. the room to investigate Martin. In We're in a vent. Found a secret room yes. after puzzle solving. Creepy. Can feel my power growing, feeding off my anger. Father would say I've lost the path of balance, that he could never understand. The only way to fight a monster is to become one. We can take so the devil's breath folder. It's a trap. Yeah. It's a burn room. Wired to destroy evidence. Uh oh. Here. He knows, doesn't he? He knows we're Spider Man. Sweet. Martin. You're back. I can get that. And heading off again shortly, I'm afraid. Just needed a few things from my office. You must have heard about City Hall. He caused the explosion in yes. City Hall. They've been corrupted. I finally got your evidence. Head to the Feast Center in Chinatown. What am I going to find? A nice lady named Mae Parker. And some really weird stuff hidden in Lee's office. I think he's going to use something called Devil's Breath. What is it? A substance created by Oscorp. Can I call you back? I think you'll want to hear this. Wait, why are you whispering? In the middle of something. How about we catch up over dinner? My place? Oh, sure. Parker! Exciting news. Cut by the lab. Until now, we've been looking at prosthetics from the wrong perspective. Why restore people to what they were when we can make them better? <laughs> Everything okay? This is all your fault, Norman, you son of a... So, uh... I hope you don't mind me asking, but it seems you and Norman have a bit of a history. We were lab partners in college. Decided to start a business. Both had visions of changing the world just in different ways. You were at Oscorp when it started? I'm half the reason it's called Oscorp. In grad school, everyone called us the O's. Add Corp to that and, well... Well, why'd you leave? Norman became more and more obsessed with genetics. He started a project I considered unethical. I chose to leave in exchange for a settlement, but that money didn't last very long. If this project doesn't work... Let me, let me just fix this up. Why don't you do the honors this time? He's grabbing his arm like he's in pain. It makes sense. He needs the prosthetic arm for himself or else he will lose his arm. It works. Next episode, we will have a dinner date with MJ and she's going to explain what she's doing. Neural Thanks interface. for watching. Bye bye. It's a lot of work for you to do by yourself. Sure you can handle it? Apparently 